Alright guys, so on my left here is the Apple AirPods Pro Gen 2 and over here is I have my Oppo Reno. Alright, so it has this Bluetooth off, so let's see if this can be connected with an Android device. Open it up. Refresh. Aha! Oh, interesting. You see AirPods Pro popping up here. Right, so let's tap on it. Pair with the device. And it's connected. You see, you will hear a chime. Instantly, it says AirPods Pro is in use. It uses AAC in use for phone call and media playback. Let's go into additional menu here. Right, you see the device name, disconnect, unpair, you can use it for photo, for phone audio, media audio, contact sharing, okay, you can activate that. And over here, you also have an option to use high quality audio, AAC codec, let's see if you can switch it off. Yep, you can switch it off and it uses SBC, AAC, SBC, AAC, SBC, right, I'll turn on AAC. And this is actually a device Mac address, alright. so. Only thing you won't see here on an, on an Android phone is um, the additional menu for the AirPods Pro when you're using it with an, with an Apple uh, iOS devices like you know the iPad or the iPhone. So let's see if the earbuds will actually still stay connected after we have closed back the case. So it's actually currently in use, you can see here. So let's close the case. Okay. It drop back off here and now we open up the case and it's connected back all right so that's good that's very important to know because some earbuds have actually tested um, the earbuds will actually still stay connected after I've actually put the earbuds back into the case which will actually drain battery unnecessarily all right so pause all right guys so I have with me here it's Apple AirPods Pro Gen 2 and this is actually my iPhone 12 mini. So I'm actually going to do an initial pairing with an Apple device. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to open up the case and it's going to have a pop-up. It says not your AirPods Pro. AirPods Pro cannot connect to this iPhone and then there's a connect button. Push it up a bit more. Connect. It's going to say hold and press and hold the button at the back of the charging case as you can see here all right let me tap focus a bit more all right you see there yep this one okay so press and hold on it Okay, nice. So it's actually currently connecting. Okay, so over here it says take out your earbuds. Okay, I've taken out my earbuds. Okay, you can actually do swipe down, swipe up for volume control. Right. Press and hold for noise cancellation or transparency. Go to control center, you can press to view additional controls for noise cancellation and transparency. You can set up Siri, which I um, not now, so I'm gonna skip this. All right, announce calls and notifications. So when supported, Headphones are connected. Siri will announce a phone call and a time 70 token. You can respond by speaking to Siri. Uh, okay. So this is personalized spatial audio. Use your iPhone to scan your ears. Okay. I'll do it later. Alright. And it's done. And you can see here the battery life. Right. Just now earlier on. Okay. Nice. Done. And besides that, you can also see that I have them here on the screen. So let's head into the additional menu. Right. So you can see here, right and go into the setting, you'll see here it says add 
AirPods Pro, you'll be able to see more options. It says my earbuds are actually at 83%, my casing is actually at 51 right? Noise cancellation off, transparency. Press and hold earbuds over here, it's noise control. You can be Siri, okay, nice. We'll set it up a bit later for Siri. The ear tip fit test. Check the fit of your of your AirPods ear tip to determine which size provides the best seal and acoustic performances. There's adaptive transparency. Loud noises you're exposed will be automatically reduced. Automatic ear detection. Connect to this iPhone automatically. Or you can do it when last connected to this iPhone. Spatial audio. You can personalize, alright. We can do that later. Microphone. You can choose which one you want to use the microphone. For me, I automatically switch. Okay, enable charging case sound, which is very important. Optimize battery charging, that's very nice. Show in my find accessibility. Alright, you can see how long you want to press. Ah, this is additional. You can have noise cancellation with one AirPod. Okay, allow AirPods to put NL cancellation mode when there's only one. Ah, okay, you can on that. I'll switch it on. Okay, tone sound. Wow, you can also volume swipe. Alright, so volume swipe is actually switch on automatically. You can turn that off, but I'll just leave it on. Alright, adjust volume. I'll just do it default. Back. And this is the version. My current version is 5A374. Right, the case version is 3.62.1. Okay, 